Hey guys, today I have a little bit different of a video for you and I'm really, really excited about it because I had a company send me this little carrier and I swear it's blonde proof. I was able to put this thing together by myself. I know that doesn't sound like a huge accomplishment, but for me, it is. <laughs> They're doing awesome and they have a lot of treats in there. Check it out. Well, it's their first time inside. Looks like they're in a clear mailbox. <laughs> well, at least they're not in the snow. <laughs> so I want to talk to you guys about it because I used it on a recent flea, flea, flea fright trip. Oh my gosh, can't speak. They're gonna love this video. They're definitely gonna send me more stuff. So, I got my big conure, my little conures. Just kidding, for those of you that don't know, Comet's not actually conure. He just looked like it. Although I thought I was only gonna use it for my sun conures, cause it's kind of small, it actually worked amazingly well for my medium sized birds, my Gala or Rose Breasted Cockatoo Bondi, and my Congo African Grey Cressy. We got to free fly at some different locations, whether we were tromping through the desert or if we were going up on some dunes, which is pretty much the same thing, still desert. It came in super handy and none of my birds were fearful of it or had a problem. Now that said, my birds aren't really fearful of much. Um, I use all types of different carriers. I have specific ones for the airlines because airlines don't allow any damage to carriers. So I have airline specific carriers. Then I have the enclosed plastic ones that I usually use to bring into arenas or theaters when we perform there. And I have the big metal dog crate type ones that we often use for free flight trips in the back of our truck to go out to locations that aren't very far from where we're at or transporting from. So I use a variety of different carriers. I have some friends who recently got those super expensive acrylic ones that are really long and um, super clunky to walk with. So I refuse to get those. I would rather just carry my bird from A to B and it would be a lot lighter. This is cool because it was super light and it made it easy for me to transport a bunch of my birds from my bird trailer over to the dunes and have the ability to put any away that maybe if, if it got too windy or if I needed help transporting them all back and couldn't carry them all. So I love this and I'm gonna show you how simple it is to use and assemble. So here we go. The first thing I'm going to do is take off the strap so you don't have to have it and it's probably just gonna dangle in my way for right now, but I did carry this over the shoulder. Now the perch goes in super easy, but I'm gonna take it out. Seriously, it just pushes in, guys. It's, it's super simple, um, which is a win for me. I do simple. Okay, so that's it, that's the perch. That's how quick and easy it goes. Then, to obviously this is just a zipper guys oh my gosh it's brilliant you just unzip the freaking thing unzip and it goes totally flat and then you just zip it back up to be complete so i'm going to leave it open for now because i haven't cleaned it since i used it it doesn't get tons of airflow through it it only has a few air holes but that actually worked in my favor because we were on these dunes it got super windy and it was awesome that it kept my birds from getting blown around in there. So I'm a fan of the fact that it keeps the elements out while also obviously having some airflow, which is necessary. But for me, I didn't want the wind penetrating through the entire carrier. And I also used it to bring my birds outside when it was snowing. So it was also nice for them to not get snowed on when I did that. So I'm all for this carrier. It has multiple uses for me. I'm loving it. I didn't know that I would like it this much, to be honest. There's people that have sent me products, which is why you've never seen a product video, um, that I absolutely detest. And I don't, um, I don't not tell them that. <laughs> so 
This is probably the first one that I've gotten that I've been like, oh, hell yeah, it works. Um, and it was funny because when they sent it, they were like, hey, can you, do you want to do something with this? And I was just like, let me test it out on my flight trip first. And then I'll let you know. And um, huge fan. I think for me, the biggest thing is that I can use it for multiple size birds. So I'm going to show you. You just simply follow the zipper all the way around. And that makes your carrier you guys this is like I feel like they had me in mind when they made this so simply I just simply threw some paper towels down as the poop catching stuff but it's really easy to clean uh, so whatever you use you could do whatever I'm gonna go ahead and put my perch back in just to show you guys how easy it is now that I cleaned it and also you can move the perch around I put it in the center just because that works best for me and my birds but you can put it in any of the holes kind of sounded really dirty not even kind of it definitely went there I'm just gonna keep going and be glad Dave's not editing this video Otherwise, that would be the intro. Okay, that's it. Simple. Didn't even have to fast forward through that. Guys, I love it. Um, I'm going to leave a link to it. I put it to my... Um, I added it to my... Blah, 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 blah. I still can't talk. I'm going to leave a link to how to purchase this on Amazon through my affiliate link. So go check it out in the video description if you guys want to get your hands on one of these babies. Because I think it's awesome. I'm a fan. I'm going to be using it all the time. So yeah, that's it. Fully closed. This is all just kind of a mesh netting. I think that if my medium sized birds were in here for an extended amount of time, they could definitely ruin this mesh and they could devour the perch and all that jazz. For the ways that I used it, it was simply to take my birds from point A to point B. So for example, from my house, to my front yard where my trailer was waiting to put them into a different travel cage. Also to take them from my trailer to a flight spot. So it worked for me because they were busy, they were anticipating being able to go fly or go somewhere a little bit more interesting. They weren't getting bored in here and then looking for ways to destroy it. So keep that in mind. Um, I would say it's for shorter times or for little birds that are less destructive.